Hey fellas, back again. I've been working on this Klingon Katinga at the same time I've been working on the um, Enterprise back and forth. One's drying, one's doing whatever. I'm painting one thing, so I paint another. So I just thought I'd show you where I am. This is the uh, base color, and then I have a few uh, odds and ends painted uh, different colors here, but I haven't haven't got into the. This is just the base color. I still got lots to lots and lots to do. Um, I bought the lighting kit. Wish I hadn't. Pretty lousy, but I'm gonna go ahead and use it, and then I'm gonna add to it like I'm doing on the Enterprise. I have to add to the lighting kit and change some things. Like Kenny says, this screen uh, do not support screen accuracy. Um, let me turn that down a little bit. That was a little loud. Um, the uh, lighting kit. Okay, um, the nacelles. Well, they were white. I didn't like that. I changed it to green. I just like the green better. I know it was white in the motion picture, but I like the green better. And there was no lights up here. So, well, I got an LED up here and I drilled a couple of holes. So there'll be a few little few little lights up in the front uh, too. But it's, uh, it's going to be green, not white. Um, then this... Uh, uh, nacelle or the the torpedo in the front of the ship um they had just a regular old white light in there and uh you know the back uh little red piece in the back there if you got the lighting kit you got the red stuff with it um well i didn't like just a white light in there um so i got one uh oh what's going on oh there we go um, I got an orange one and whoop, can I light where you can see it there we go and it pulses so that's good enough for me it'll look like it's firing close enough and then uh, there were a few others um, in the um, throughout the the ship here and there that I've added to because I didn't think there was enough light or I've changed the color um, in the back to to red instead of the white they're all white but when you put the white behind the the red glass piece the red plastic uh, it looks pink so I'm actually I actually changed the uh, lights to red uh, in the uh, this right here um, I didn't like the hot spots and I didn't think it was bright enough with one white light uh, so again I switched them to red lights and I've now made five lights across here five red LEDs and then like the uh, Enterprise uh, deflector dish I'm gonna put a little thin piece of this uh, thin piece of this real thin uh, styrene across the front here and then it glows the perfect red color and you don't see any hot spots or anything so I'm just kind of modifying the uh, the lighting kit so it'll make it a little easier uh, but and it's easy too because you just cut off the LED they have and put on your own or the color you want or whatever um, the um, the different colors I was gonna mask it and paint it I, I don't like wasting I think it <laughs> uh, say wasting I shouldn't say waste I don't like um, getting the the masks because you know you just throw them away when you're done and it seems like a waste 40 bucks you know for for masks but my goodness if I tried to tape that and uh, you know cut the tape around and everything and leave cut marks and all kinds of stuff I just I didn't want to do it so I broke down for this one and I thought well the big 350 I can break down and uh, I got the uh, Aztec dummies uh, masking kit so hopefully that'll make it easier. I've never used masks before, never tried that. So hopefully it'll make it easier to put masks down and, and uh, spray some different colors, some darker greens and stuff like that on it. So anyway, that's where we are right now. And uh, when I have more to show you or I get more together, I'll make another update. All right, guys, two videos in one day. Well, that's a record for me. I might have done it once before. <laughs> I guess it's not a record. Anyway. You guys have a great uh, rest of your week. God bless you all. Make it so.